Hi guys, uh, today I want to take you through how to set up a VPN connection uh, on Windows 10. Now um, before we start, uh, I'll just say that you, you, you're going to have to have uh, already have a VPN service account with a company. Um, now there are hundreds of VPN providers out there. Uh, some of the big ones are um, NordVPN, uh, that's who I go with, and BT Guard in Canada. It's another one I I have personally. Um, so you'll need those uh, to have the, an active account, and you'll also need certain details. Um, that is uh, the VPN server address. Now there's <clears throat> there's likely to be many different addresses uh, depending on the size of the company you're going with. Uh, Nord VPN has about Oh, I think 50 servers worldwide, uh, each with a different address, and the, the address will be something like uh, vpn.btguard.com. All right, so it'll be in that format, URL format. Uh, the VPN type, you'll need to know what uh, uh, protocols it supports. Uh, the most common is PPTP. Uh, there's also IPsec uh, LT2P. Um, so there's a few there, most likely it'll be uh, one of those three. Uh, you'll need your username and your password. Now that should be enough uh, just to connect. I will say that VPN connections are very fussy, so don't be uh, sort of too upset if it doesn't work the first time. Um, and make sure you go and look at your VPN provider's help page. Okay, so once you have all those details, we'll get, st get stuck into it. Um, we go to the Start Menu button, bottom left, and then we go to Settings, and then we go to Network and Internet, and you'll see a, an item there called VPN when I click that on, and you'll see there Add a VPN Connection, so we click that on. Uh, first option, VPN Provider, we want to make that the window, Windows built-in provider. Uh, the connection name, now that can be anything you like, um, obviously if you've got different VPN accounts make it a descriptive uh, uh, name, I'm going to name this NordVPN because that's what the connection is with Nord. Nord. Now the server name or address, um, I've uh, chosen one of the servers from NordVPN and that's it there, ca6.nordvpn.com. Uh, VPN type now the automatic uh, works sometimes and not others. You, you could try automatic first. If it doesn't work, then specifically choose the protocol uh, that the server supports. All right. So most likely PPTP. And then type of sign-in info. We want to leave that at username and password. And then we go ahead and put in your username and password, which I'll just do now. And then we click Save. Now that will give you uh, the interface here with the Nord VPN connection. Just click on that, and then you'll see the Connect button. So we want to click that, and that should go through all the uh, the process and uh, complete the connection. So we're connected now. Um, now it's taken me a few goes to um, to get to that point. Uh, so there are some some issues with the uh, the built-in Windows. VPN. Uh, if that doesn't work, there are other options. If you go to advanced options, um, you can. There's a, a setting there automatically detects settings. You may want to click that on. I had that on then when when I did that connection. Um, so there's that option there. Other uh, companies like BT Guard, uh, they require you to disable IPv6 on your system or for for that connection uh, in order for it to work. Um, so the, you, you really need to go to the VPN provider's help and support page and they'll have tutorials there um, on how to connect. But uh, this should work for about 60-70% uh, of you and uh, you're all good to go. So any questions or comments guys, leave them down below and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.